So I'm an irresponsible person. I have work tomorrow, and I just got home from the Vanity Fair, Oscar party. Lorraine, I can't take it off. Okay, so that sounded like, um, I can't take it off like it's stuck. No, uh, I can't take it off because I never want to. Welcome to another episode of No Light Late Night Chats with Sarah Hyland. This is the Oscar edition of No Light Late Night Chats. Someone let me hold their Oscar tonight. Freaked out. They let me hold their fucking Oscar. And now I'm so happy award season is done because I will feel so <laughs> less in it. They have an in and out truck on set today. And I got two double doubles. Fuck her off. And at the end, after she goes, just you know, kick them off. Oh, you can't do it. Yeah, yeah. just after she escapes. Going down. I'm eating in between tapes on set. Be Mark. Okay, so we just finished filming that scene. I've been eating both of my double doubles. I got two of them. And I'm almost done. Someone said I couldn't do it. I can. Thank you so much to the In and Out guys for bringing us in and out on set. I'm super happy. Though there's this one guy named David who didn't believe that I could eat two double doubles. I'm about to show him what's up. Nice. What's up, David? Nice. There you go. <laughs> I ate both of them. Good job. Oh, good job. Season nine. I will say this opening of Machu Picchu is just like they're in Cusco and all I can think of is Paul the Lava Cronk Or just said I love you I'm not going to lie to you like like his excuse for the future, just in case anything happens, is like, well, like, I was in love with both of you, so I never really lied to you. I swear to God, boo, just turn off the TV, turn off The Bachelor with her face. Do you really not like Ari that much? He was in the middle of telling Lauren how amazing their lives are going to be together, so maybe not. I'm gonna overanalyze Ari for a second. The lightning. He's like, I'm in love with two women, and he keeps going back and forth between the two women, like, as soon as one proves to him that she loves him more than the other one. So I really think he's just scared of rejection, and he's probably just gonna pick whoever the one proved to him more that she loves him more, and that they'll work more. For you, I thought that I had love all figured out. I thought that Don't let her talk. Don't let her talk. Stop her. Just stop her from talking. And <laughs> You're making it worse. Stop. Do they, like, tell him, like, to, like, wait for her to finish talking before breaking up with her? Or is, like, this a him decision? Because I really, honestly, it's, like, not okay what he's doing. I knew you would be when he said that. I would have slapped him too. I did fall in love with you. Bam. So you're still in love with her? Okay. I'm just. Well, I wish you the best. Oh! No. Sure, until like three hours ago. <laughs> 
Yes! Preach! We all know what happens now. Now he proposes to Becca, and then there's gonna be an awful breakup scene. And then I don't know what happens after that, but he gets back together with her. And I commend Ari for following his heart. I just hope that later on tonight he apologizes and that he says he made a mistake by actually proposing because that was a dumb fucking move. Last few times we've been hanging out. Is that's how you talk about your fiance? And the reality of it is that. Hanging out. Hung out like, again. Oh. Losing the possibility of maybe reconciling things with Lauren. Do you want to be back with her? I want to see if there's a possibility. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Yes, girl. But I not your fiance. So, you, are you going to be half in with her? <laughs> no. So, <laughs> what? I want to take the risk and see if there's a possibility with her. Oh my god. How is she? I, I know that you're an incredible woman. Uh, who she took it off. I wouldn't have taken it off before punching him in the face, honestly. Pushing back those feelings and trying oh my God. to see if it could work for us, but I just felt the further along we got, the further I started drifting away from the possibility of trying it again with her. No. Well, yeah, because that's a normal relationship. You should have... Oh my God, I really hope she didn't get that tattoo for him. Yeah. What was that tattoo? Was that... Uh, it was a a fly, fly? A, bee? a bee? What are you doing? Do not go back in. She said to fucking leave. You don't do that. You don't fucking do that. Because as soon as you go, we break down, and you come back and you- Are you okay? Like, do you have indigestion? Like, no, she's not okay. Can we talk just a little bit? Oh my god! What do you need to hear from her? Don't, Don't touch her. No, she wasn't ready. No, all back tomorrow. Oh no, how long ago was this? I'm not even ready for this. That was tonight. Why is Barkley? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Did her rose just fall off the stem? <laughs> I don't even, I can't, could there not be a more like better, what? 